Welcome to Weekly Digest, where we highlight the works of ministers of government as they push the administration's development agenda. 25 individuals are set to embark on specialized training in air traffic control assistance and aeronautical information services at the Guyana Civil Aviation Authority and the Civil Aviation Training School. This six-month program has attracted participants from regions 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9, and 10. Pilots and air navigational officers who are late are the ones who create accidents. Because when you are late, you have to cut corners to make up for time that is lost. The necessary checks, the necessary protocols are not in place when you are late. So punctuality must become a lifestyle. 150 children from Maka Arcadia graduated having participated in a government-sponsored literacy summer camp. It's not the usual summer camp that you have where you just have activities that you're rolling out, all the recreation, all the sports and the games. This was a little bit more and I thought Mocha needed it because of when I came here, what I saw, what I felt that I can do to help as well as residents who wanted to be able to participate in this. And it was to help you to get to a stage, all you youngsters, to get to a stage of where your reading will become so easy for you and better for you that you will do much better when you go from one grade to the next until you exit primary school. The Ministry of Natural Resources on Wednesday inked a U.S. $1.8 million mineral mapping contract with U.S. company Global Venture Consulting LLC. The mineral mapping project is intended to build on a previous inventory that was completed in 1968 which currently needs updating. This is in line with keeping with what our government has been always advocating for and that is economic development being balanced with environmental sustainability. What is also important too with this project is identifying whatever critical minerals that may exist in Guyana. And tying this into our low carbon development strategy and the whole conversation on climate change.